right, good morning. This is Melinda here. So today, well, this morning was exciting. It is about 8.08 in the morning. I just put my daughter on the bus. But let me tell you about my morning. Um, so this is day two of the um, Prove It 10 Day Challenge. Um, and I was so excited to wake up because I just still had a little bit of energy. Like this is what's tripping me out about this product is the amount of energy that kind of just carried me throughout the whole day. Um, I didn't go to bed till like 1.30 and I was ready to go this morning. I got up. I took off all my, all my clothes because you know when you get on that scale, you don't want to have any clothes on. You want the bare number. Woke up, 163.8. So yesterday I was coming in at 165, came in at 163.8. Your girl was excited. I don't know if it was water weight. I don't know what it was. I don't care. But <laughs> I will take that 163.8 any day. So I was really excited about that. Um... So I was like, shoot, let me, let me get up and get myself, let me put a little makeup on this morning. Uh, so I put on a little makeup this morning. You know, my husband, work, he's a firefighter, so he works 24 hour shifts. And I know when he comes in in the morning, he's probably like, this girl look crazy. So I'm like, let me surprise him and have a little makeup on today. So anyway, so I'm um, very, very happy with day one very surprised with the amount of energy I uh, like I was saying yesterday I've just been feeling like I just don't have it all when it comes to energy because I have so much going on um, with kids I have one in college one in high school and one in elementary school so they all have their own little separate dramas and then being married and then then trying to just work a full-time job it can get really stressful and I also you know sell on eBay and Poshmark and things like that so just trying to do all that it gets stressful and um, I was like I need this product in my life because I really want to just kind of consolidate some things and make it a lot easier for myself every day so anyway I am very excited so what I decided to do differently this morning this morning is um let's see i am going to take the caffeine free this morning because i honestly this is maui punch caffeine free i honestly is don't need that much energy this morning because um it's just a lot like I need that kind of energy that I had in the, yesterday morning. I need that in the afternoon when everything is just like a lot. So I am taking this this morning. Um, now, don't get it twisted. When I took that caffeine-free coca, whatever it was, I still had the ketones going on. I was in ketosis and I had some energy. But girl, when you take that charged when you do the charged okay so i'm excited i am going to try this is lime time and i'm going to switch it up i'm going to do the charged later on in the day because you're supposed to take this after your meal your lunch so i'm an intermittent faster my body has been uh, become accustomed to that um I eat between the hours of either 12 and 8 or 1 and 10. So my first meal will probably be around noon. And then I will probably take this maybe an hour later, maybe two hours later, depending on how I feel. Because I'll probably have some coffee. I might have some coffee this morning, some black coffee. I don't know. But this will be later. And... So I ended up, this is, okay, so I found out this is the free gift that they give you when you do the challenge. Um, really don't know what it is. I have to do some more research on it, but, oh, upgraded electrolytes. The original Mitoplex, okay, upgraded electrolytes. So I ended up adding this to that drink in the morning. Um, I started off drinking it without it. And I was like, you know what? I don't want, I don't feel like separating it because this may not taste good without 
the other the other drink so I just added both of them together so that's what I'm going to do I'm going to put this one and the Maui punch together this morning and we'll go from there so your girl's down to 163.8 I'll take it I'm very excited I still got nine days to go so we'll see I am technically 10 day 10 pounds away from my high goal weight which is 153 where i am actually very comfortable in my clothing right now things are really snug but i refuse to buy brand new clothes um because i have nice things that i can wear at a smaller size so i am very close to being able to fit into my clothing very comfortably and i'm excited about these 10 pounds definitely would like to lose a little bit more than that but we're going to take it one day at a time. Oh, as far as, um, what else did I do yesterday? As far as physical fitness, don't have a lot of time, but I have been doing the, um, what is it? Shanti, it was the transformation 20. So it's just 20 minutes. That's all I have time for. Um, I, I do have a gym membership trying to get out there, but, um, it's been hard. So doing my little 20 minutes. And let me tell you, he's kicking my butt because I'm with that uh, transformation 20, you use a step. You don't have to use a step, but I did get a step off of Amazon and <clears throat> he about killed me yesterday in 20 minutes. So I'm making sure that I at least work out four times this week. I'm going to push for five, but if I don't, that's okay. I also took because on keto, sometimes you feel like you're a little backed up. You see my shirt? Cute. But um, in keto, sometimes I feel a little backed up and I don't like how you don't use the bathroom a lot. Um, so I'm definitely up in my um, water. I do drink a lot of water, but I just feel like I'm still not drinking enough and I need to up that. Um, I, so I decided I really wanted to go to the bathroom this morning. So I took a, I have this, um, this tea that I ordered from this girl, um, that you're going to go the next day when you take it. So I, I definitely feel flushed this morning. So, um, I did use a, one of those detox teas last night. To just calm myself down got up this morning felt great um so that's what i'm doing so it's a combination of things it's the intermittent fasting i do 16 eights i'm doing this prove it 10 day challenge i'm doing um uh, shanti's t20 and i don't think i'm gonna incorporate the tea every single day because it really makes you go but if I'm feeling a little backed up, I will use the tea. Sorry to be so, that might be a little TMI, but oh well. So I will keep you informed of what I eat today, um, how I'm feeling with this product, let you know how the Maui punch tastes and you know, I will let you know. So, oh, there is a link for customers who would like to have other people um, try the product. Um, so I put that link that they gave me in the description box. So if you want to go ahead and try out this amazing product for yourself, feel free to um, click the link. I, I, I know that um, once you get off the challenge, if you want to get on like an auto pay, you can do that um, to get it on a regular basis. Sign me up. I cannot imagine having that kind of energy and not having it all the time. So I am going to look into the different types of packages that they have so I can have it on a regular basis. But um, I know that if, if you, you know, one of those things that if you invite somebody to try it, um, if they get on it, you may get some type of, type of discount. I'm going to look into that. So anyway, I know that there is a link at the bottom if you would like to try and do the challenge as well. Thank you. Okay, so I just mixed up the caffeine-free Maui Punch put it in here I'll just be sipping on this while I'm working um, let's see what it is and that's really good 
I really like this taste. This, it just tastes like fruit punch. I put a lot more water than I did yesterday because the taste was very strong. It was good, it was raspberry lemonade, but it was strong. This is perfect. So this is the caffeine-free Maui punch. Really tasty. Tell me you want me to start. I did start. How many? Keep it going. Just keep it going. So I'll show you the time. Let me share with you guys how the devil is a liar. My husband wants to come home with a big old box of duck donuts, knowing I'm on a keto diet. Look at this. Look at this. I was like, is this man born of Satan? You want to bring home a whole box of duck donuts. Oh, I can't. And I'm not. I Listen, y'all. I am addicted to carbs. So this keto diet is not easy for me. And for him to just bring this whole box, that just, like, dude, what, what's wrong with you? But I'm going to be strong. I'm going to walk away. Walking away from the donuts. Walking away. 